The OSC College of Fashion Lagos is Nigeria's internationally recognized school for fashion art and designs. Fashion from ages past has been an aspect of culture that evokes the very spirit, nature and power of the people that own it. The Nigerian spirit and culture has always been a very vibrant, colorful, flamboyant and an irrepressible one. Chief Mrs. Chade Thomas Pham, who is notable for kickstarting the Nigeria fashion industry and from being the first to own a boutique in the country, set the pace for the Nigerian fashion industry in the 1960s and 1970s. The OSC College of Fashion Lagos mission is to train, develop and support its students to become celebrated fashion entrepreneurs. It's a bridal corset. I, I actually made it with um, a satin. It was my first trial ever. Then I did it with a bustier cut, with the patterns and everything. Then I insected bunnies inside of it just for the corset. These are the back looks. No. So then I, I'm actually making a, a fabric rose to design it. I also made this. This is one of the selects. This is one of her class projects. This is one of my class projects. And then so. what we pride ourselves over is the finishing. Yeah. So if you look inside, you see how it's really well finished. The zippers are fixed there. Yeah. The Everything. way it should be finished. So the inside is neat, neatly done. And before you and then the it, it fabric be the roses. Next there are one. This is my first male shirt. I did it yesterday. Yeah. With the guidance of the teachers and the videos that they show us, wherever they're teaching us. As you can see, it's not your normal local standard. As for a first shirt, you can only imagine how the second and the third could be. So you can only get better. The school founder and principal, Olushola Babatunde, talked about what drives that to establish OSC College of Fashion. For me, it's a calling for me. It's something I noticed right from when I was a young girl, that I'm gifted with some things that comes to me more naturally than to others. So I took time out to really you know, look inward and meditate and pray on what I'm supposed to use those talents for. And I realized that okay, I had a dream and I saw a big school where I was training people in different departments. We're doing different crafts and different skills were, were being taught in the school. And I saw that I was teaching a girl how to sew and I asked the man that was showing me around how come I, I'm, I'm teaching her how to sew, I can't sew. And he said, when you wake up, you go and learn. So I woke up, I was working in an NGO then and I resigned from work and I went to learn. So, and that's how it started. The school manager and proprietor, Akudo Arago, echoed the founder's thoughts and displayed some of the works the school has produced. We have different levels for our school. Our, school, our levels run from level 1 to level 6. Our level 1, which is, we call it the SMO Corp program. The SMO program, you have nothing to do with the patterns. It's usually for factory owners that want to employ us as students, our, our alumni to work with them. So we teach them how to do proper tailoring scenes. You have to so, know how to tailor different types of scenes. And at the end of the program, you should be able to couple a shirt, a trouser, and a skirt, children's wear, and all that. I wanna thank my God for blessings and letting me go, na na na. I wanna thank my fans for support and letting me blow, na na na. Lord, I give everything to you, my life and soul, na na na. I wanna thank my mom for bringing me into life, na na. I dedicate everything to you, my fans all over. This is what you learn in the textile and design class. You get to learn this. Actually, it starts from it starts from the foundation. They start with this using the cardboard. So they go on to other areas using the cardboard. It advances to this. After learning the different the different types, knowing how to sew your different types of scenes neatly, 
you now use it to couple a shirt like this, a male's clothing like this. It has to be neatly done and neatly finished. Show our students the different how to blend different types of colors and also how to dye their fabric. So this is being made by students. You see, I go do, and I go do everything. 